Hi friends, welcome to Testing Tutorials Point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about parameterization and data driven testing using our Cucumber framework. How we can able to parameterization our test case. See in the previous feature file, I teach about how to log in a web application and verify that at the simple format I explained and the same thing you can able to learn there and come to here and you can able to see here. I like future file selection the value that need to be parameterization which future file we are going to selecting there we need to do for parameterization I'm putting the values with the consequent brackets or double quotation the parameterization changing the scenario to the scenario outline means we are writing the scenario right to changing for that and scenario outline and adding the example section and add data from the uh, parameters in the example section updating the step definition to get values from the future files uh, example section values and we need to run and verify these are the seven steps we are going to do and now i'm going to show you how we can able to see in the previous video i explained this is the my future file correct now I need to change to scenario to scenario outline. Scenario outline. Okay, now I change to scenario to scenario outline. Here this is the concept third step we done okay now we are going to changing the values here we change the, uh, when we are using the when user enter username and password this is we done for here hard coded you can able to see here hard coded location 1234 i given the value correct now if i want to use these things and i just i'm going to change for my future file value that is called a less than and greater than I am going to use here. Braces. And here also changing. Okay. Now both the places I modified. Okay. Now next step is we need to add for example section example section and we need to write and enter now my example section is ready then i need to open this brace and name which we are using the same format we have to provide here and this one and password and we need to write for password name and we need to write for password 12345 and second also we can write that same format okay now i'm going to do for this is run place run not print format pretty format it will do for the allocation of that class uh, that ended feature file okay now my data and both the things are ready then i need to go for step definition to get the value from the feature file into example section means this wherever these values we want to use in the particular location we need to go there here and i need to change here we can able to change because our condition it is like a, we can able to use double quotation and take the value or else we can able to do one more thing like brace dollar and star brace close the same format we can able to use for password because we have multiple values to add it and here now it is hitting here and we need to read the method also because our method is having username password correct for to 
read that values for parameterization these two values and I'm just I'm going to add here string name and string password and the same thing I'm going to copy pasting here name and password okay and the same thing I'm just a string name okay and here what will happen if I want to do this verification and just here text one hello plus name and plus and to verification but it, it will take the runtime the name and it will modify correct and now mine is verification is completed and this is also completed and I just I will run my scenario and check whether it is working or not just I am running this one and it will initiate our browser and it will see now it is taking two times login page because I have we have two uh, values username and password is at uh, two times it is present there it will take the two times that is the one and whether it is taking the values from the future file or not we'll see in the parameterization because we provide the example section we have provided okay now it is not taking that values okay no problem and I am closing this one because already one failure happened. Yeah, it is taking the username and password. Okay, the method is able to definition step two parameters or step definition, and it is taking the two arguments again, but when it is reading the value, it is not able to take that particular value. Okay, now we can go to the step definition here, and I can able to use one concept here: cap starting time and end of the method. I'm going to use dollar. The same thing I'm going to use here: the cap and dollar. Okay. Now my is ready. Then we can able to. In case if you thought using this cap and dollar also, if it is working, then cool, no problem. In case your method is not able to read at that parameterized variables like values from your future file to the method, then you can use for this cap and dollar in the static cap and ending for dollar then it will take for your values and the previous section we are not used for cap and dollar but and here we are using because of we done for example and uh, parameterization values then it is required to do read the method values also and now it took the values and it is verified now you can see the passing condition is passed these are way we can able to implement our parameterization and data driven framework using our Cucumber framework. This is a simple format I explained and you can able to do for your critical examples also you can try and your local then you can able to understand what exactly it is. Okay. Thank you for watching for this video. I hope you enjoy this video. If you like this video, please like my video, please subscribe my YouTube channel. Don't forget to share your friends and colleagues. Thank you.